I decided to try a Kindle, so um, I took this one. It has the, the best price on the market. It has all that you need basically for uh, an ebook. So um, this is it. Kindle number 10, or as far as I know, it's called Kindle um, 2018. Uh, it has a 6 inch uh, touch display, built in light, wireless, and 8 gigabytes for storage. Let's unbox it and let's see how it looks. This is my, um, my first Kindle, so uh, I don't know what to expect. Let's see. Uh, I was I was curious, and um, I said, "Why not? Let's try something like this. Maybe maybe a tablet is not good enough, and we need a Kindle to read some books." So let's put it here. We have this cable to charge it. Micro USB and also I believe for uh, transfers this is it Kindle okay it's small plastic slim okay you it's very very easy it's super light you can definitely hold it very very easy and for a longer time this is the screen the charging port and also you can transfer files here it has 8 gigabytes and Let's turn it on. Okay, this is on the screen. Okay. <laughs> it it feels solid. Some sort of glass or a super strong plastic, I don't know but it feels uh, okay when i decided to to take this before uh, i i said uh, this to myself okay let's try a kindle and let's get this one because it has a very good price also it has some very interesting features it has um, a touch screen and also it has uh, a backlight uh, uh, for uh, for the screen so um, here uh, in reality it looks different than on the camera um, here in reality you don't see the light that you see here on the camera and on the camera it has a yellowish light here in reality the screen looks white I don't know uh, why the camera sees in in this way something like this if I press uh, the autofocus um, so indeed it it looks uh white look maybe now in uh in natural light something like this okay let me try to change here light maybe this will do something i don't know anyway this is it, get started, preparing your device. And I said this, you can, uh, you can use this anywhere. You, you have light on, uh, for, uh, for the screen because um, also uh, I, uh, I wanted to, to take another brand uh, with micro SD card, with more uh, formats compatibility for uh, the books. But that one didn't uh, offer uh, this uh, light for the screen. And I, I, uh, I said, I think this is, uh, this is very important because 
uh, let's say that um, later in the night or uh, when is not enough light uh, from the outside you want to read something well with uh, without the light here uh, for the screen you have to put some uh, some some light on it with something i don't know you have to to turn on your uh, your lamp or your light in your house is not okay uh, here you can um, control the 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 brightness and um Yeah, in my opinion, it's uh, way better. Okay, let's connect it to um, to wireless, but maybe I don't want. Okay, uh, you can skip. The touch screen for um, for my surprise works great. Okay, don't expect to be something like um like a tablet the experience i mean um settings this is the maximum brightness let me put it like this and indeed it's super super powerful um this is it and maximum What can I say? Um, I like it. My first Kindle and I like it. All settings. I know um, I know what expectations to have here. Um, basically, again, it's not a tablet. It's an ebook reader. You read books and definitely this screen um, will not respond uh, to your touch like a, like a tablet uh, it's much slower but it works uh, it works good device options okay back and let's see if we have here uh, a book or not some demo Your library okay so tap the right side to turn the page left to previous uh, tap to the top the page to display the toolbar okay and this is how it looks let's see definitely it's nice to to have a touch screen then to have buttons here because um the other option was with uh, with buttons here at the base and definitely it's it's good to to have um to have a touch screen and It's a, it's a great experience and I believe with a, um, with a newer, uh, with, an, uh, with a better Kindle, I, I, I mean here uh, a newer generation uh, or um, a more expensive one, I don't know, probably the, uh, the experience it's better, it should be more powerful I think, but anyway, um, it's very interesting for, uh, for the first time. Okay, definitely a very interesting experience. Okay, let's see how do I um, how do I change the light here in uh, okay here settings. Without the light, you would have it like this, and you will need. Some, some other source source of light uh, for your screen especially um, for uh, for night or or when you don't have um, enough light in your house and it will be much harder to read 
just like a book. You, you cannot read a book without having a light uh, turn on. Uh, I mean, when you know what I, what I want to say, when uh, is not enough light around you. Uh, so uh, with this one, you press here and you control your light and definitely it's a it's a better way to go then without uh, without uh, uh, light for the screen i like it simple simple candle <laughs> okay very easy to hold it works fast enough for an uh, ebook reader what i don't know what expectation to have it's decent look and you can put your books on it um i'm very curious how it will work when um when i will put more books on it and uh, it will have uh, let's say those eight gigabytes full with files we will see it there then. Until then, definitely a very interesting um, device. I will post more videos with it and with my experience. I will see how is the battery and how well I will adapt to, to, this, uh, to this gadget. and if I will keep it or not. Reading options, okay, back. This is it.